Okay guys, I have a new video where I will discuss something that all of us should consider asking ourselves. What major brony slash pegasister YouTubers in the community influence us? In this video, I will be talking with some bronies and pegasisters that are dazzled by other brony slash pegasister YouTubers in the community, and we will try to figure out what kind of brony slash pegasister YouTubers inspire them. Let's start. What YouTubers in the Brony community inspire you? Uh, Markiplier? Who? No, come on! What? Think again. PewDiePie. Wrong! Come on, think again. Jacksepticeye? Uh, no, come on, guys! I'm thinking of aspiring Brony YouTubers. YouTubers that post things that are My Little Pony related. Dusty Cat Rhodes. Don't tell me you guys have never gotten the let out. Noat King, I need Monty. Ring any bells? What about Palestino? AC Race Best. Saber Spark. Oh, what are they teaching this place? Okay. None of you guys know what I'm talking about. Very well. Okay, let me start by saying that my influences in the fandom are a little shy FIM and AC Race Best. This reason is because they do vlogs, and I just did a vlog of me at BronyCon this year in 2018. And there's so many other reasons because of the content that the two have been posting, which I will post more of eventually. Let's hear what Rain Power's influences in the Brony community are, shall we? Well, hello there. My name's Rain Power, and I'm not exactly the most active member of the Brony community. And I'll tell you why that is. It's because, just because you can call yourself a brony, doesn't mean you have to devote your entire life to it. I have other interests too. And that's the beautiful thing, that's the one thing that most people don't see about the brony community. They think we're a bunch of obsessive freaks who treat it as some sort of religion. What's up, Devin? I don't even know what that means! <laughs> but anyway, no, 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 no. I may not be an active member of the brony community, but that doesn't mean I can't enjoy their content. That doesn't mean I can't create content of my own. Now, I'll tell you exactly the kind of brony and Pegasister YouTuber who inspired me to contribute to this kind of community. I love Kim Possible a lot. He is one of the most perfect specimens of a Pegasister you will ever find. Now, not obsessive, very artistic and creative, and I love the OC, I just, I love, I, I love that about the Brony community. There's just, ah, uh, so many possibilities for, um, original characters, original fiction, original anything, and, uh, who else now? Uh, Dr. Wolf. Dr. Bloody Wolf now. Dr. Wolf is by far one of my favorite Brony YouTubers of all time. Take the boring. I don't know why I did it like that. BORING concept of psychology. Like going to a psychologist, they're, they're asking you about your problems, or oh, you know, they're, 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 they're condescending and they cost so much. But no, you, you have an original character, Wolf, essentially with psychotherapy kind of sessions with characters from the MLP universe and with other OCs, like um, Josh Scorcher, uh, the mysterious Mr. Enter. <coughs> And, uh, yeah, it's just, ugh, it's, it's, uh, it's a beautiful community, and those are the kind of people who inspire me to, to do stuff, to create art. And that's what it is, it's not, it's not weird, it shouldn't be shunned, because it's art. It's as much art as if you were to go to whatever fandom and you were to contribute to it, it is as much art as that. There's no such thing as a bad idea, just bad execution. And I'd say we're pretty good for that. Alright, well, that was that. That was pretty fun. Um, Alright, um, thank you, Calvin, for letting me contribute. Psycho Yiko, be sure to subscribe to him. And uh, if you're interested in, um, in, um, if you're interested in wasting your time, come over to my channel, Rian Power, maybe subscribe when I um, do fan fiction readings, um, fan fiction reviews. I'm, I'm just a bit of a fanfic, not really. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you later. Okay, I think I've said enough. In conclusion, 
Let's just say that all kinds of people in the brony community have influences, bronies and pegasisters that inspire them to do what they love doing. I hope to post more vlogs like Little Shy FIM and AC Race Best and start my version of Bronies React starting with Season 1 and going from there, like AC Race Best too. But for now, only time will tell if I make more of this MLP slash brony related content. That's all I have to say, and I hope to see you guys soon. Bye for now. Thank you for watching, you guys. If you like what you saw, do not forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe for more videos. Bye for now.